Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. This episode contains the harvest of an animal. everybody, Cam S here. Today we are going to be doing something a little bit different for the channel. We are going to be going small game hunting. So I got the GoPro hooked up to the gun and we are ready to go. Shortly into our walk before we saw any squirrels at all, we ended up seeing these three does bedded down off in the distance. After walking around for a little while and seeing nothing at all, I was getting a little nervous that the incoming snow had got all the squirrels bedded down just like those deer. But fortunately, we finally saw some movement and noticed two squirrels running off in the distance, so we decided to track them down. Unfortunately, I just grazed him on my first shot, but he gave me the perfect opportunity for a second one. So let's switch to the gun cam. Got one down, there's another one up in the tree, but it went into a hole so we never got a shot on it. And I noticed that the GoPro kind of moved around a little bit in between my first and last shot, so I do not know how well any of the footage got, because I don't even know if that camera was on it, so we will see if I got any good footage. Let's keep going. Shortly after moving on from this spot, we walked right on top of a squirrel, and before it ran too far away, I decided to take a shot. But yet again, I did not land a very good first shot, but it gave me an opportunity for a second one. Apparently I need to work on my aim a little bit better because every single one has taken two shots so far. So hopefully the next one can be more. After moving on from this spot, we noticed a squirrel at the very top of a tree and all we had to do was get in line for the shot. But yet again, my first shot did not hit him very well, so I had to take another one to finish him off. Number three. Shortly after harvesting this squirrel, we moved on to another one, but unfortunately, the GoPro was not recording, so we did not get the gun cam. And I finally got one down with one shot. After walking around for a little bit longer, we decided to move some trail cameras around, hopefully being able to see some squirrels on the way. We did not see any more at this point, so we decided to call it a day and start heading up to the car. While heading up to the car, we had a squirrel run right in front of us, giving us the perfect opportunity to fill our bag limit.
apparently I finally got the hang of the iron sights because I got this one down with just one shot as well. So just like that, our day in the woods was over. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And I also hope that you enjoyed the gun cam. Hopefully it made you feel like you were actually out in the woods hunting with us. I just wanted to try something new and I hope you all enjoyed that perspective. And for those of you out there wondering what I was using to harvest sea squirrels with, I was using a break barrel single shot 410 shotgun just with the standard iron sights on it. So that is why I was probably missing some of those longer shots and it was taking me two shots to make because I did not actually have a scope on the gun itself. It was great to be back out in the woods and I have not been small game hunting in a very long time so it was nice to have a very successful hunt. I hope you all enjoy the variety that this video brings to the channel and I hope you look forward to more different videos in the future. I'm trying to maintain weekly uploads for the winter so I'm planning on going ice fishing very soon and possibly even coyote hunting because I just got a new gun for that. I also may be doing some product reviews if I cannot get out on the ice or in the woods. So if you have any suggestions that you would like to see on this channel, please leave them down in the comment section below. I will do my best to try to do any of the videos that you guys suggest because I need some ideas to keep the videos going this winter. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching and I will see you next time.